After the fall of the Berlin Wall in 1989, agents from the Stasi, the secret police of East Germany, tried to destroy evidence of their activities. They shredded around 40 million sheets of paper by hand, producing around about 600 million paper fragments, which are presently stored in 16,000 large bags. A manual reconstruction of these documents of immense historic and personal importance is likely to take centuries. 400 to 800 years are estimated. In 2007, one of our IPK was tasked by the German government with developing a system for automated virtual document reconstruction. Today, the system is used by the agency of the Federal Commissioner for the Stasi records to virtually reconstruct the content of selected bags. Meanwhile, we are still developing and optimizing the so-called ePuzzler software, which is the core component of the entire process, to make the processing of the remaining bags possible within a time frame of 10 to 15 years. The process of uh, virtual reconstruction consists of three major parts. First, the digitization of the paper fragments. Second, the puzzling of the, the digital images of the fragments. And third, the post-processing and evaluation of the reconstruction results. The use of the software is not restricted to Stasi files. It has already supported several financial and criminal investigations to reassemble evidence. But the impact of the ePuzzler extends beyond reconciliation authorities. It is about to be put on a range of other users worldwide, for example, to safeguard precious artifacts or manuscripts, or even to support a virtual restoration of ancient Egyptian papyrus fragments stored in a Berlin museum. So the number and the diversity of inquiries received about the ePuzzler suggests that on commercialization it could immediately attract projects worth several million euros.